Hey guys, this is Tara Hate from How to Play CA. Today I'll be showing you guys how to remove Key Raider from your iPhone if you accidentally installed it. Um, Key Raider is pretty much just like keylogging people. Uh, it's some kind of a Chinese Trojan or something, some kind of a Chinese virus. I mean, uh, what it does is take all the information that you have, like whatever you type in your keyboard, it saves it. So. Um, to remove that completely from your iPhone uh, without losing your jailbreak is pretty easy. All you have to do is um, download iFile from Cydia and after that you choose iFile and launch it. Alright, so when you get to the I iFile, you're automatically going to be in this uh, little page right here. Uh, in order for you to actually delete it, you have to go to dynamic uh, I believe dynamic stat statics or something. Uh, but anyways, to, to do that, all you have to do is back out of war, back out of this, and then you have to scroll up a little bit and you will see library. And after that, you have to choose for mobile substrate and then dynamic libraries. Yeah, that's what I meant. All right, so when you get to dynamic libraries, uh, these are all the, uh, you know, the all the stuff that you have, all the tweaks that you have installed here. And to actually find it and to delete it, it's pretty easy. Um, these key keywords right here would be will be in the description below so you don't have to pause the video or anything what you need to do is you have to select all of this like one by one copy it and then go to your um, dynamic libraries and then paste it just to see if it's actually in there um, apparently I didn't download it so I wouldn't have any search results so let's say you actually do have that search result and if that happens to you all you have to do is to delete it is to actually hold it down and then choose select and then select again uh, for the make sure you ch choose dot dylib and also dot plist because it's very very essential that you do uh, because if you're to delete one and not do the other one that means it automatically regenerate the you know the other format or other uh, file so anyways go ahead and erase it just like that and it will ask you if you want to move to the trash and you choose uh, move to files to trash as simple as that and I really hope you guys didn't actually got keylogged or anything like that mainly because um, it's it's really you know you cho you have a lot of information in your phone saved up and you type a lot of information like your passwords or your bank and everything like that so make sure you guys do search it if you're jailbroken just to make sure um, you know you guys don't have it or anything like that and also one tip that I would like to share to you guys is that make sure whenever you guys trying to um, uh, whenever you guys trying to install a tweak just look it up in YouTube and see if there's a review there available and if there is and then after that you install it just to see how it works so you wouldn't just install it right away uh, by looking at uh, you know Cydia and then usually people install it just like this so they just look in changes to see the most recent update right here and then they just save it uh, so yeah just make sure you guys go through YouTube and make sure every you know things that you download is kind of safe I guess uh, thanks for watching guys I hope you guys found this video helpful if you did like and subscribe it would help me out a lot and uh, I will see you guys in this video